and they've escaped the clutches of ISIS militants in Iraq. But back home in Kerala, for the 46 Indian nurses, it's a new struggle to find jobs and financial security. 26-year-old Jensi may have escaped death only to face a massive struggle back home. Since she's come back, she's been filling one employment form after another with great urgency. She's among the 15 nurses who did not want to leave the war-torn Tikrit in Iraq. For Gen C, returning home means financial disaster. Like her, many moved to Iraq because they were promised a minimum salary of 45,000 rupees per month. But 15 of them have returned without even getting a penny for all that they labored. Kerala government has decided to mediate between possible employers and Indians who've returned from Iraq. 20 nurses have been offered on-the-spot jobs, but most have not accepted it yet. Saying the minimal salaries of rupees 10,000 to 13,000 for nurses in Kerala cannot save them from loan sharks. They pointed out two issues, the future employment and also their uh, loans. So Mr. C.K. Menon has generously offered this uh, 3 lakhs rupees to you. Each family. There is renewed hope as these nurses behind are getting to know that their arrears would be paid by the Iraqi government in the coming few weeks. Even while they were in the captivity um, of ISIS, all they asked those people was would they be able to pay back the salaries? An indication of the challenges that they were preparing to meet once they returned to Kerala. With camera person SP Babu, Sneha Koshi for NDTV.